What's up everybody, Drew right back at it again with another video. Today we're going to be talking about a game called Contain. This was a game that was recommended to me by one of my subscribers who said, Durag, if you make a video about Contain, make sure you tell people that it was I, Audit Lamau, who suggested it to you to make a video. Okay, well, you got your wish. Yeah, today we're going to be talking about this game because he recommended it. I honestly don't know too much about it, so this is my first time really looking at it. According to their description, Contain is a first-person cooperative tactical shooter with with in-depth character and gun customization. Contain requires calculated teamwork. Practice your tactics and test your equipment before the mission. At this point, it doesn't actually have a release date. It is to be announced, but it is being made by developers who have not made a game before, at least as far as I can tell. I don't see anything on their Steam just yet. Nope. This would be their first game. Let's just go ahead and hop into their video here. I'll uh, commentate over it if I see anything that's interesting. And uh, yeah, afterwards we'll talk about the video. So uh, let's go. Okay. Decent customization. Pushing into this house. Nice camera angle. Cool camera angle. Nice camera angle. What the hell? What is that? Oh! Oh! Okay. Interesting. What's he running from? Contain special attack division. What are they containing and what are they attacking? This is a long outro. Cool. All right, so let's go ahead and talk about it. So obviously they're using bot store assets, which there's nothing wrong with that. You know, when small developers don't have the funding to make their own stuff, they just go and they buy something from the store. It's a lot cheaper to do when they just don't have the funding to get anybody to make this type of stuff. But I mean, it looks like they're actually doing a decent job at making everything look like they work together so there is some thought and effort being put into it the customization here obviously looks very bot star asset but um i mean if it gets the job done it's not a big deal he's holding a vector here but all the clothing is changing we got what looks like a SWAT vehicle here, contains special attack division. Working in progress, performance asset graphics animations are all subject to change. Yeah, like I said, bot store assets are usually like a placeholder for when they want to, you know, implement better stuff. Like you never want to stick with a bot store asset unless it's not very noticeable, you know. But it seems like they got dropped off here and they're pushing into this area. Uh, one thing of note, this dude is already dead here. Uh, this looks like a car was exploded. So we're coming into a place that definitely doesn't feel like your average SWAT 4 type of map, you know? This guy looks like he's in heavy armor too. One thing I do want to know is, is this a single player or co-op game? Hold on a second. Looks like single player and online co-op. Okay, cool. And the camera zooms in onto his helmet. That's pretty cool. I like this camera angle, but what doesn't make sense to me is that isn't this thing supposed to be the camera? Shouldn't the camera be in front of this? Seems odd to me, but okay. And then I like how there's like a little effect here that makes it look like it's bugging out. Now I'm not sure if that's because of the rain here or if they're like at some place that looks like an anomaly or something, I don't know. Getting into their first house. Ooh, that walking animation, can I see that again? Oof, uh, that looks a little odd there. But he shoots this dude, and we kind of get like a bit of the shooting gameplay, which doesn't look that good, but you know, I'm not going to knock it all that much because it's an indie project and they're using bot star assets. You know, it's just kind of what I expect, basically. The walking animations look okay going up the stairs. doesn't look too bad. Uh, one thing that I noticed about this scene is that the bullet sounds 
sound very stock in nature which again makes sense because they're using a bunch of busts or assets it seems like i've heard these bullet sounds in almost every game that i've played but they eventually get replaced that running animation though looks a little odd this almost looked like ready or not not gonna lie got the customization here it's a it's bot store but i mean or at least it looks like it i'm not saying that everything is bot store but i'm just saying that it looks like it but they're doing it in a way so that it's actually good they're changing it up a lot it's not the same thing they're you know putting different parts on it and stuff one thing to notice about that scene hold on a second he shoots this guy here but then there's a second guy or whatever the hell that is some sort of essence or what i don't know he's like a red guy and i think they keep shooting at it too yeah they shoot at it but it cuts i like this camera angle I hope they keep that. They always show off like camera angles like this in every tactical game that I play, but we never get those camera angles unless you mod something in. And then we get this. Looks like some sort of red crystals that are kind of lining up the wall here. They have like this, I don't know if it's a SWAT officer or if it's like a bad guy with a bunch of armor on, but he's just floating there in midair. When they get closer to it, you can see that there's clearly a wall back here. There's nowhere for them to go, but then the wall kind of just opens up and then his limbs detort and just get messed up and the wall carries him like down a some sort of railway or something so weird then we have the last scene of this dude running away i'm not sure if it's because he saw something and he's running or what but it's definitely interesting to say the least i'm gonna go ahead and add this to my uh wish list click yeehaw if you want to link to this game too i'll also put it in the description seems like a pretty interesting game not gonna lie what are we containing and what are we going to attack is it gonna be one of those games where the swat officers go in but they end up dying so they end up calling this particular set of specialists to contain whatever the hell this is who knows what i do know is that i'm pretty interested can't wait to try it out whenever it decides to come out there's no release date on this as far as i can tell but it's interesting nonetheless so that's really all i got to say about this what are your guys' thoughts tell me what you think down below because i'm gonna get the hell up out of here if you enjoy the fact that i cover games like contain then be sure to like the video share the video comment down below if you're someone that's new to the channel be sure to subscribe and ding that bell so that you can get more content on contain or any other game that i decide to cover if you're someone that would like to support the channel check out my patreon hop on that join button send a thank you in the comments anything helps to keep the channel running and with that all being said i want to thank everybody for coming out to watch and i guess i'll catch you in the next one Bye bye